Hello everyone, Max Knight here. Let's play Shining Force 2. Now, I started this video very late. Er, I should say it's very early in the morning, it's after work. I said I wouldn't do this again. Or, or did I? Anyways, we just got a new member of the force. Let's take a look at him. He's level 14. He only has a middle sword. This puts him weaker than Kiwi. And that's sad. He's weaker than Sarah. That's really sad. Um. Back to Bado we go. If only for a longsword. And yes, I am wasting time. Oh, and also something else about Luke. He has 19 defense. This guy cannot take a hit. I would have designed them so that they could at least take more than, like, one hit. Anyways, um... Guess what do I want to buy? Longsword. Costs money. Um... So anyways, um... I just, like I said, felt like wasting a little time there. And I, I mean, I could have done this off-screen. Uh, I'd like to apologize for not uploading any videos over the weekend. I just didn't feel like making this, because, you know, obviously, I haven't made this yet. Considering I'm doing this Tuesday morning, which is my Monday night upload, I consider. Uh, anyways, I said no, we weren't going to fight the Kraken. Uh, because we are in no shape to fight the Kraken. We probably won't be in shape to fight the Kraken when we're supposed to fight the Kraken. Is there anything over here? Like Mithril? Or is this, like, worthless? It's, it's worthless. There's, like, no point to it. Whatever. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, this comes out over here next to Ribble. I'm going to save in Ribble. Because, uh... That way, we won't go all the way back to Bedo if we have to, um... If we have to, like, die or regress or whatever. Because that would be kind of annoying, going all the way to Bedo And having to walk all the way back. Um, I realized I could have uploaded Trazia videos while, uh, you know, while I wasn't making Shining Force 2 videos, but what fun would that be? I did that one weekend, and I kind of regret it. I'm um, getting off here. There's more freedom of movement. Um, shoot, I don't even want to start the next battle. But let's, uh, let's run around and talk, or something. Um, what to talk about. See that cross section, that T intersection right there? Yeah, the moment you, like, raft into that particular, like, square, the Kraken battle starts. And if you're not, like, starting to promote people, or, like, at least level 21 or something, then you're not gonna survive it. You know, it's it's very difficult. That's Hassan over there. Hassan. However you want to pronounce it. Um, it's actually not as... Like, it used to be more prosperous, I guess. I think, like, you get the chance to see the town a little bit in Final Conflict or something. And, uh... It's in a much better shape than it is here. Um... But there's a very fun character there. Someone, and I really mean that. Honestly, I plan on using him too when it comes time. Uh, I know I'll, that'll get a couple of screams or something because a lot of people don't consider him very good. There's something you have to remember about him. He's pre-promoted, level 4. But he has stats equivalent to a level 30 promotion. That's the key. And since I'm doing early promotions, this man will look like, you know, a guy.
god among characters. I mean, not Vulcanon like, you know, but still better than everyone else. Um, it's interesting, and I I realize I'm doing basically nothing right now. Why don't we go find something better to do than just walk around here? Um, I've had some interesting conversations on uh, the game of a huge Shining Force 2 forum. Uh, mostly, you know, talking to or answering questions about things, you know, who to take at creeds and who should I use for my party, you know, that, those kinds of questions. Um, I'll be honest, you know, you really should use whoever you want to. I mean, it's really experiment, have fun, if it doesn't work out, egress, try again, you know. There's like a square here, I think, that lets you fight this battle again. Maybe. I can't remember. Shoot, I didn't want to do that. Um. But, um. Oh my. I can't remember. Uh, what I was saying. Oh, um. And, you know, I'm going over. I was going over all kinds of things like, you know, the advantages of using all the different. Uh, wizard type. There it is! I mean, it's so stupid to do this battle again, but, you know, it, at least I won't die here, in comparison. <laughs> it's just random, you know. Um, and everyone here will give one experience to everyone. Except I think maybe, possibly, the witch might give, like, one, uh, like, two experience to, uh, to Luke or something. Because Luke is weak. Actually, so is Peter. Actually, Peter's level 15. Kiwi is weak. Uh, even Sarah's level 16. I thought there was someone else that was level 14 than Kiwi. Ah, well. I guess Luke and Kiwi are the only two. And while Luke now has 30 attack, it's still pretty weak. I mean, 30 attack compared to, you know, 39 or 41. Who has 40? Slade has 41. Power ring. Otherwise, it wouldn't happen. Um. Actually, you know what? Guess who gets that now? Luke gets that. Um. But yeah, so. I mean, I'm, I've been enjoying myself, you know, answering people's questions and stuff. And it's, it's an honest... You know, it, it, not just opinions, but also actually knowing what I'm talking about sometimes. I just played this game so much over the years that I know a lot of it by heart. And I used to be, you know, just just as uh, as unknowing about different characters, like thinking, oh, all pre-promoted characters are bad, don't take Freja, he's terrible, you know, things like that. It's a few things to realize is that... Um, it's a very deep well. Um, a few things to realize is that, you know, saw a lot of those pre-promoted characters are just as good. Especially, you know, ones like Gan or Gyan, or however you want to pronounce them. Um, I know I'm going to get some comments on that one, probably. Um, let's see, uh, and, and other ones aren't, aren't quite as good. Everybody likes to Everybody likes to say, Lemon is so good, and I was saying, yes, he is. And honestly, he works. I mean, if you need another Baron, he works very well in that capacity. But uh, at the same time, you know, it's not really necessary. I know. I, I, I've done nothing but talk for this entire thing, basically. I went and got some... Uh, got a longsword, and then, like, did nothing but talk. Hey, Mayor. Ancestors came from Rune. Now, okay, don't, whatever. Da, three times. Um, but, uh, no, oh, I'm getting really close to, I should have finished this some time ago. Uh, or maybe, I don't remember. Well, anyways, um, yeah. So, just, you know, for those people who might be watching this, especially people on the Shiny Force 2 forum, just, you know, pick who you want for your, you know, for your party. It really shouldn't matter what anybody else thinks. You know, just 
have fun. You know, experiment, see who's best. I mean, I'm I'm planning on showing showcasing just about every character there is in the game, showing their strengths and weaknesses, and actually trying to prove that some characters actually are good, whereas others don't seem to think so. <laughs> Somebody out there should think, oh no, he's talking about me. Hey, what'd you talk about me for or something? But <laughs> don't worry about it. I, I, I don't mean any kind of harm to anybody. But uh, anyways, I'm going to wrap this up. When we come back, we will go on to the next battle. Um, this has been Max Knight. Let's playing Shining Force 2. See ya.